Hello everybody. This stuff is super dusty, the chicken feed that I made because I put like diatomaceous earth in it and some charcoal to help clean them out. <laughs> but it's pretty dusty, especially when I'm scooping it up. The quacks are enjoying their time out this morning. Over the last couple days, I've moved these birds outside, the bigger ones, and they are doing so, so good. A bunch of them slept under the coop last night, which we are working on fixing. <laughs> this electric fence is working really, really good. I don't know if you guys can tell right now, but the creek is pretty muddy. The ducks have been in here all morning. Turn this off. It's super cool to see Sadie as she just does her own thing and doesn't try and get in here with the chickens, doesn't chase the ducks, doesn't run off. She just does her own thing. She'll get curious and wonder sometimes, so that's why I still have to keep an eye on her, but she's doing really good. Chicken at the chicken coop. Oh, yeah, there is one. Probably from last night. They're really pretty. They've been laying under here though, which kind of stinks. That's my chickens for the morning. You can see these guys will all eat separately. The one minor problem I'm having with my feet here is that the chickens will tip it and all tips under the coop. So I have this sitting on it so it's heavy enough. But I'm going to take this, put these eggs in there. I'll collect these this evening because these are probably yesterday's eggs. We'll just take this hammer and set it here. I was filling this up with feed, but I have to make more chicken feed. That is something I won't be doing this video because when I make chicken feed, it's so dusty that you can't even really see anything. Turn the fence back on. So if you guys remember, the grass was pretty tall last year in the creek and it was a big pain. I even put the cows in the creek for a little while. So this year I'm trying to stay on top of it, so like once a week I'm trying to come through here and just trim it all up. So probably later once it warms up a little bit more. Sadie, you stay over here. Once it warms up a little bit later, I'm gonna trim the inside of here to get all this grass. I mean, don't get me wrong, I like that there's a little bit of grass on the inside of the creek sometimes during the summertime. It gave the cow something to eat. It becomes a problem when the water can't even flow through. So it's just better to do it this way and it helps this whole field out so that the field doesn't flood. So Sadie is back in here. Lucy's fencing is still all set up and ready. It could probably use tighten a little bit, but once it dries up just a little bit more because we got rain for like the past like three days, I'm gonna spread all this dirt here out and then she can go in here. The only other thing that needs to happen is we need to get a piece of culvert or pipe or something to get her across here because she's probably not going to want to walk across this. Rebel chicken. Hi, Molly. One of the jobs today is to put straw in here. So my ducks have been rioting lately and not wanting to lay, to lay eggs. There's no eggs in here. And I'm really starting to like a, a duck egg for breakfast every day. There's a lot of cleanup with all this wind over the last couple days. It's not like I review products or anything, but I will say this is one thing that I highly recommend for anybody, whether you have a farm or not. We got these little things for this hose so that it's cool up, pops right out pull up, it goes in. I mean, they are a lifesaver because all I have to do is go like that, pops out, pops back in, just go like that. Last night it was like 30-ish degrees, so everything is frozen again. It's March 30th, why is this still happening? The purpose of this video was to talk about how spring is in full swing. Come on, dog. Go. 
I put some feed on the inside of the duck area. Hopefully they'll go in. They'll start going that way once I walk away, probably. We're going to take this down to the chicken coop right now, though. Get it all set up. So I was thinking we could probably just put this stick right here. So I've already done about half the feeding this morning. We've done the chickens and the ducks. Now we just have Molly, the chicks inside the barn, Carl, and these, uh, the other grower pigs. This shouldn't take us too long. hasn't made too many friends on the farm. The ducks and chickens don't like her. The pigs don't like her very much. They, she's afraid of the cows a little bit. So the only friend she has made is Carl the pig. Here you go, buddy. Here's your breakfast. Spring is definitely here on the farm now. You can tell there's more birds chirping. There's buds on the trees. Alrighty guys, well that's the morning chores this morning. I hope you guys have enjoyed this video. Let me know down in the comments what kind of video you guys would like to see me make. And I know that there is a lot of new people on the channel, so I would like to thank all you guys for subscribing. So if you're new to this channel, you might not know entirely who I am on the backstory of this farm. I'll leave a video up here for you guys so you guys can go check it out. It's all about myself and about this farm. So I hope you guys enjoy it too. I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.